Hello everyone, Omega here, and in this video I will be answering some of the questions you have asked me on my videos. I will only be answering questions that I have a definite answer to. Believe me, I wish I could answer every single question you have, but I do not have a crystal ball and I don't know the answers to every single question you ask me. But hopefully this is enough to clear out some of the confusion on some of my videos. So, let's get started. Augustine Dominguez asks, can you play old episodes in Super Mario Bros. X 2.0? So you can play levels in episodes made with versions 1.3.0.1 or lower, but you won't be able to play any of the Super Mario Bros. X 38A levels using 2.0. Brooklyn Sands asks, does the script somehow work with Super Mario Bros. X 2.0? Unfortunately, the scripts from 2.0 and 38A are not compatible with each other because they are two different scripting languages. Jacopo Bindi asks, How many worlds and levels will be in the full version of Super Mario Endgame? Super Mario Endgame will contain 8 main worlds, as well as World 9 being a special world. World 10 will have levels from the 8 main worlds but with special challenges that will greatly increase the difficulty. Beating all the worlds will lead you to the final special world. A lot of people have asked me whether or not you can use Super Mario Bros. X and the executive file of Super Mario 63 on Mac or Linux. Unfortunately, they will not work because executive files are solely meant for Windows operating systems and only work with Windows. So I received a lot of comments asking me from the video about how to transfer your Nintendo Switch screenshots and videos to computer where I got the wire to connect the Nintendo Switch to computer. So I got mine from GameStop. They're very easy to find. Just ask for a Nintendo Switch charger at GameStop or Best Buy or really any electronic place for that matter. Angel Re asks, does it work both ways? Unfortunately not. If you were trying to transfer any files from computer to Nintendo Switch via USB, you won't be able to copy and paste the videos into the Switch folder. I know some people use the microSD card inside of a USB flash drive to do the transfer instead, but I don't know how that all works. Geode asks, if I delete my photos in my Switch, will the photos stay in my PC? Once you have copied your screenshots and videos to your computer, you can delete them from the Switch and the files will remain on your computer. So that's all the questions I was able to answer for now. I will make another video answering your questions sometime in the future. Again, I won't be able to answer all of your questions myself, but if I don't know the answers, you can always ask someone else. Thanks for watching, and I'll be back soon.